How are you doing today? I'm doing well, thank you. Okay, let's check your blood pressure. Clinical trials are a key step in bringing new and better treatments to patients who need them, but they can be time-consuming and burdensome for patients and researchers. 122 over 83, just where we want it. Hi, I'm Josh Korsnick. I take care of patients with ulcerative colitis, and I am part of a team that is developing a new way of conducting clinical trials. There are two main goals in this study. One is to see whether a special diet has any effect on the symptoms of ulcerative colitis. The other is to find out if a trial of this sort can be done at home with most study visits conducted by mobile video conference, and to find out if patients prefer to participate in person or by telemedicine. Patients in the in-person group will come to my office for four study visits over a six-week period. Study visits in the telemedicine group will be conducted in patients' homes using a smartphone that we will provide. Some patients will be asked to follow a special diet for the entire study. Others will receive standard dietary advice for ulcerative colitis. Everyone in this study will fill out questionnaires about the impact and severity of their disease. The subjects in the at-home group will fill them out on the smartphone, and the in-person group will fill them out in my office. All subjects will keep a record of everything they eat and drink for four days before each visit. In the telemedicine group, food and beverages can be entered by speaking into the phone or by using the keypad. The in-person group will use pencil and paper to record their food and drink intake. Before anyone can enroll in the trial, they must discuss the study with me or my staff via a video call and review and electronically sign an informed consent form. All participants will have a physical exam and a flexible sigmoidoscopy with biopsies at the beginning of the study. This will be done in my office for the in-person group. In the telemedicine group, these routine procedures will be performed by each patient's own doctor. In addition, visiting nurses will come to patients' homes to collect blood samples. Great. See you in a month, and be sure to call me if that headache comes back. If you have ulcerative colitis and would like to learn more about this study, please review the information at dietaryuctrial.com. If you think you might be interested in participating, please fill out the Am I Eligible questionnaire. You can also find out more by emailing or calling and speaking with a member of the study team. Thank you for watching.